What's going on guys? Welcome back to another Your Real NBA video. So in today's video, we're going to be talking about Wendell Carter Jr. and what I think he can do in this upcoming season. So as you all know, Wendell Carter Jr. was the seventh pick in the 2018 NBA draft for the Chicago Bulls. He's a center who has showed glimpses of becoming a really good defender at the NBA level. But on the offensive end, he hasn't shown much. He has dealt with some injuries. And, you know, he wasn't used correctly in Jim Boylan's system. Like, as you all know, Jim Boylan wasn't that great of a coach. So it did stunt, um, you know, Wendell Carter Jr.'s growth a little bit. But also, Wendell wasn't really that aggressive. He wasn't aggressive enough to make a big impact in a lot of the games this past year. Especially on the offensive end. And a lot of his per-game stats took a nosedive from the year previous. And some of those struggles have continued into this you know preseason in the first two preseason games he hasn't really done that well and um hopefully he could turn it around because billy donovan does have some good experience with developing big men he has coached for stephen adams and joe kim noah back in college so he does have some experience with big men that are you know pretty good so it's safe to say donovan will be able to make some type of impact on wendell because wendell has some of the most untapped potential in the league pretty much not only on the bulls roster but in the league wendell carter has a a ton of untapped uh, potential there's a video out there where he was making three-point range jumpers and i think he does have the potential to become at least an average shooter um from the three-point range but it will definitely take some time i don't think we should expect him to start you know splashing threes next year maybe the year after you know if he steadily improves but he definitely has shown that he is going to be able to at least somewhat be able to become a three-point shooter if he's wide open so it looks like Wendell will be looking to become a good player on the offensive end next year like I said he'll he'll need some time because especially with his shooting because he did take a step back last year with Jim Boylan. And he's going to have to, you know, regroup, um, be more aggressive, and all this stuff. And funny that I say be more aggressive because, because he has said, and I quote, this is a quote from Wendell Carter Jr. Next year, y'all definitely are going to see a different window. So I think I interpret that as Wendell, you know, saying that he's going to be a more you know aggressive player on all sides of the basketball offensive end defensive end and all of that stuff he already has the defense down he can improve on defense he does have you know a little foul trouble but on the defensive end i think that he's pretty much got it uh, on lock um on the offensive end i think if he bees more aggressive Especially in the post, I think Wendell Carter has the potential to be a really good post player and a really good player when it comes to passing in the post. Wendell Carter does have some good vision when he's in the post. I think a lot of people sleep on that when they talk about Wendell Carter Jr. And Wendell Carter is not, you know, the typical center where, where you throw lobs to them and they grab rebounds and block shots at the rim. Wendell does have some potential to become a really good player you know passer when he gets double teamed or when a um another player tries to help off of someone else and stuff like that and he does have a some good footwork in the post and he does have some you know uh, ability to you know make mid-range shots and three-point shots so i think he does have the potential to become a really good offensive player with the right coach which you know hopefully Billy Donovan can be that coach and I think he can become a, an elite shot blocker and you know just an elite player when it comes to protecting the rim and yeah I think we should just expect him to take a huge step this next this upcoming season so yeah I think that's all I really had to say um hopefully you guys like this video hopefully you guys enjoyed and I'll you know comment down below what you think about Wendell Carter Jr. and what you think he's going to do next year and you know I'll just I'll see you next time